Hi! I'm so excited. It's kind of late. It's literally 11 p.m. but I have too much energy. Tomorrow I was gonna start my weekly vlogs, but I just got so excited because I'm planning for it and I'm like up and I'm like really going. And um, I'm just really excited. Tomorrow's actually February 1st, so I feel like everything's just coming together. Starting to do so much stuff, like excited, preparing for tomorrow. And I was like, you know what, let me just start the vlog. I'm going to be starting weekly vlogs, filming every Wednesday and then posting every Thursday the next week. I really want to be on top of myself for you guys on YouTube and I'm really excited to do it. I'm about to plan everything. I have so much planned for next week as well because, okay, so basically what I'm planning and I keep looking over there because I have a little whiteboard that I plan everything on. This week is the vacay prep weekly vlog so you know hair nails makeup my hair is ratchet i have like old micro links i have to take out just so many things i'm gonna be doing this week i'm a little nervous to get started but like i'm antsy at the same time so i'll see you guys in the morning when i wake up we're gonna try to get a lot done tomorrow i'm gonna wake up and work out really early because that just gets my day started then i have my nails appointment i'm trying a new nail lady which i'm like I don't really like crazy nails, but she does like really, really good nails. So I don't know, maybe I'll do a little something. It's Valentine's Day. Maybe I should do a Valentine's Day nail set. I'm going to deep clean this and I want to donate a lot of stuff because it's stressful like packing and coming back and forth, traveling when my closet is just stuffed with clothes. It's like, ew, like you got to go somewhere. I'm going to try to clean a lot of my, clear out a lot of my closet because it's just sitting there and I know I like look at it during when I'm trying to find an outfit and I'm like, mm, I don't want to wear that. Like. And I just had that same thought for some a lot of the clothes in there. So I have a heels class at 8 p.m., which, you know, I'm a dancer, if you didn't know. Actually, I don't think I've ever danced on YouTube before. Yeah, maybe I'll try to get a little clip of me doing that. Maybe I'll eat it up. Yeah, that's just going to be the first day of my seven-day vlog. So this vlog might be kind of long, and I apologize, because every day is hella jam-packed. So you're going to see what it's like a week in my life. Good morning. I woke up. I was gonna wake up at eight and like go run immediately, but I have to walk my dog. So this is how my mornings usually go. I just got up and made my bed. I'm going to go change, put on some workout clothes, take Luna on a walk, come back, and then immediately go to the gym downstairs and go for a run. During this time, Luna is always trying to beg me to go outside. Like, look, she just scratches the door like that. Having a dog will put your schedule in check because you have no choice but to like get up and go use the bath, go like take them off for a walk. So I have to get up, change immediately, and go take her on a walk or she's gonna have an accident in my room. I cut my first like gym shark set. Be and this one doesn't even fit, so I think I'm really gonna cut it because the leggings are actually a medium, so like they just look weird. Low key. Oh, these scissors are giving. Okay, it doesn't look that good to be honest, but it wasn't gonna look good. Like it looks worse as leggings, like seriously, which sounds crazy. But I ordered a medium because I thought I was thick or whatever, and I'm not that thick. Like, girl, I'm still a swamp. <laughs> so, <laughs> you waiting for me? I slowly realized that my life is just controlled by my dog. Like I get lost around with my dog every day. <laughs> Before I work out, I drink greens every single day. Athletic greens is the type of greens that I drink. The flavor doesn't bother me too much, which I feel like it's totally like up to you what kind of flavor you like because I don't like like artificial sweet flavor that much. I'd rather it just be like what it is. I used to be such a picky drinker because like I'm really not that good at drinking things. Well, I actually learned that using a straw, like a reusable straw, really helps me because it just like shoots it right down my throat. Now, like I used to hate, 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 could not consume coffee. Now I can drink coffee. I could drink protein shakes. A little bit of protein used to give me the ache. Like I hated tasting the protein flavor. Now I drink protein smoothies, drink greens. Okay, we made it to the gym. This is my worst enemy right here that you're witnessing. This is the Stairmaster. Today I'm going to be attempting a 30 minute Stairmaster challenge. I usually do 10, 15 minutes. Like a, like a, with like a three minute warm up. So I'm like, apparently the hat is watching a Netflix show. 
But like, what? I'm not into show right now. Wish me luck. I only did 15 minutes. Like, I don't know how that girl said 30 minutes. Like, what? Are you good? That was so difficult. And I saw the comments were saying the same thing. So I know I'm not crazy because I'm very fit and I cannot do 30 minutes straight. On the Stairmaster, I just feel like I'm gonna die. But then again, my legs are really sore. And I think I'm about to get my period. I'm gonna get to cleaning because I wanna clean before my nail appointment. We're making some progress, we got some packages. Oh, I got Luna a car seat for the middle, like, of my car. Luna, it's for you, chicken, look. She got her the medium one. Oh wow, look. I only got a few things, but I wanted to make sure that the stuff I was getting to like layer with for London, because it's gonna be like 30 degrees, is good quality, so ASOS. Okay guys, I'm at my nail appointment. I'm trying Lilo. Say hi. hi. Oh my gosh, she has the cutest studio. I'm really excited, because usually I dread getting my nails done, but I'm like actually excited to have like a private nail experience. Yay! Look at the nails. I'm on a lunch date by myself because I was in a city which has one of my favorite places to eat and it's called Takaya. So this is where I decided to go eat right after um, my nail appointment. I got so carried away with cleaning up that like I just, and then I got so stuck in it. That's what cleaning is like. And then PMS caught me like midday because I think I'm like literally about to get my period. And I just like had a whole like down and I was like pissed. And then I took two um, spoons of like pre-workout and they got me like dancing i was going crazy like i'm gonna show you because i filmed it so time lapse me cleaning my closet <laughs> so tomorrow's gonna be very jam-packed to have my hair in the morning and then i have a pole class with a lot of my friends and then I have another dance class with another one of my friends and right after that so I want to get this cleaning done and I want to take this clothes to this like bin that you can just donate clothes and I got rid of so much clothes because I was just so irritated with my closet being full of stuff I was never gonna wear I'm literally baking right now I this is I'm baking a cookie brownie bar that's what we're cooking. Bars makes it sound like it's not gonna be like mushy, but it better be. But the, at my school, they used to make these. I usually, I literally made a video of my friend Delaney like three years ago where we made these and they're called slutty brownies at my school. And then people would like make these and like sell them. <laughs> I'm a baker. Like I'm not a good cook. Jada, are you gonna edit that um, cook with us? Me and Jada cooked lunch the other day, but I'm not really a cook. I'm more of a baker. Like I like to bake. I just grew up baking, but I think it's because like not to shame my mom or anything, but she doesn't cook. <laughs> I'm in my jammies. I ate the brownies and then I made. I'll probably show you them maybe tomorrow because like I don't want to go back outside right now. But today felt like productive and not productive at the same time. Like I feel like I did a lot. But I got a lot, I got nothing done at the same time. And some things are just like that. Like I intend to do more and then I end up doing less. So today, I almost forgot like that it's Black History Month. That's so ghetto of me. Like I need to make a video or something about Black History Month because like I'm playing. Make sure you go check out some Black Creators this month because this is very important that we promote each other and help each other because I was just going on a rant today about I was about to post a TikTok, but I just like don't want to seem like I'm directing hate and I'm not. Let's do better. Like let's promote black people on the platform all the time, but especially this month when you have a chance to go and support a black creator, please do it. Like now that I'm watching all these brand trips not include that many black people or POC in general, like or there's token people, it just really like hits me in my soul. <laughs> I just want us to win. So Black History Month, we're gonna put the work in, we're gonna support each other. And the biggest part of this is supporting each other. Like we need to boost each other, we need to support each other, we need to repost each other, comment. Um, you know, do all you can to support everybody because that's really what makes somebody blow up. And that sounds crazy when you think about it, but it's the truth. Like the people that blow up are so hyped up by their audience that it creates the hype. That's what the hype is. So all we have to do is support each other and bam. We got this. Okay, I'll see you guys in the morning. Hopefully tomorrow is 
more productive day and I actually get like all of this done. Um, I'm kind of hard on myself with productivity, so today was like, tomorrow will be better for sure. Good night. Good morning, peoples. It is Tuesday and I'm on my way to get my hair done right now. I'm, I'm so irritated that these extensions bothered me and I paid $900 to get them done. Um, and they bothered me the entire time because of the color of the beads. Like, be so for real. I'm on my way. I have really bad cramps this morning. I got my period yesterday and I knew I was going to, which I know, like, I'm upset about because I was so excited. You guys saw me be so excited to do weekly, like, start my weekly vlogs. And then my PMS just got the better of me. I was really upset yesterday, I feel like. Um, it's so cute in here. Period. We're see. free. My hair is out. We are free. Uh, my hair is free. No more hair. <laughs> it's time to get my toes done. Getting a massage. Alright, I'm back. I was nervous because I needed to like, I felt like I was going to bleed through. Anyways, um, time to wash my hair. I'm going to wash all of the gel and just gunk out my hair and just wear my hair curly. Now, which I'm excited about. I haven't done it forever. Look how short. Like, ah, my hair is so short now. Now that my hair is natural, I'm going heavy on the rose oil. Like, every day, rose oil will be in my hair. Once I come back, I think I'm going to do a whole healthy hair thing. Because, you know what? Why not? I don't really have that many trips or plans coming up. And clip-ins are my best friend. Clip-ins are going to be my best friend for a long time. Like, I like having long hair. I feel prettier with long hair. Like, I feel like I like look more girly, but I feel so free. The fact that that shower was just so, like, short to the point my hair is, like, at my shoulders, like, I'm happy because my hair is short and, like, I just don't have to put so much effort in right now. I just need to give my hair a break. My scalp, like, feels, like, tender. All the things. But I'm happy. My hair is gone. I'm bald. We're back to curly hair. I just put in my curly extensions. Yay! Yeah, I'm excited. This makes me like not want to get braids, but that's the plan for London at the moment. I'm thinking about getting um, French curl braids on Saturday. So on Saturday, we'll see what I feel like doing. Braids are just easier because I don't have to do my hair in the mornings. And they just look good in every picture, never bad hair days. You know what I mean? So I'm thinking I'm probably going to end up doing that. <laughs> But we're back to curly. I think I'm gonna go to the mall and then I have dance class. Hi vlog. Hi. We're at CBK in the mall. We're just gonna do some shopping mm -hmm. and we're just happy hour, y'all. Yeah, we about to get home. <laughs> at least you're gonna walk out and not pay. Guys, he left. Like he left without paying. Paying. Guys. There's a guy There's drunk a crazy at happy man. hour. Drunk at happy hour. And he just left without paying. And he left without paying after having dancing. like seven glasses of wine. And he started going up to people and dancing in front of them. And he just walked out. But no one's stopping him because like they don't care about that. Living your best life, I guess. <laughs> We're going to um pole class right now. Today's been long. So I've done a lot today, which is crazy. I've been like here, there, there. Hey. Um Fun. but I'm excited for pole class and I'm going to heels right after I have my heels in my hand. Yeah. How are you feeling about heels class so far? Heels? Yes. I mean, <laughs> um, I'm scared. You're scared? I should have brought knee pads, but um, good little workout in the beginning. But I have no core strength, so that's kind of. <laughs> All right, PJ. <PG. laughs> Here we <is> are, <laughs> But with everything we've been through, you've been to, you've been one sided, you've been solid. No, I had to see it live before I got it. You really witness a nigga climb from the trenches I know they wouldn't put you at a head I do admit it like guys when you say it, So I feel it how you feel it right now Been thinking about what it taking next Wanna run it by you, send a text, I know it's late Every time I shoot that shot, no, I net it I ain't stressing, I ain't worried about the pressure It ain't nothing, I've been vetted This test the rama in your section, know you ready Need you to drop that pen, let me slide in my presence Let me lock it in, I bet you never regret it I can show you some things you ain't ever We just got out of pole class <clears throat> we said beginner it was pretty simple i didn't get any clips but i'll insert a clip of me doing it from my phone i just didn't film it like in landscape but what did you, you do um i think that it was fine 
<laughs> I don't. The lady though, she was just teaching it kind of on. So her, the timing didn't really exist in her combo at all. And so, <laughs> it's a, and that's funny that Jada picked up on that. I could definitely tell, but if Jada but I did cheer, did, and so mm. like I'm, oh, if yeah. it's one two three four, it's one two three four. But like, I not know okay. it was like this. So everybody was just at different times. So whenever we were going in the groups, I'm like trying to match my group because that's what a group is like you're supposed to be in sync but mm -hmm. i was just like you know what, fuck it. i'm just you have to be out in your own life and pull yeah you really have to be in your own lane because what it is but they were doing it. um is that side it was it was interesting for sure to say the least but timing does i feel like timing doesn't matter as much it really doesn't she should have honey are getting ready to go into Higa's class right now there's like a fire class going on right now but it's okay you're gonna be distracting you're gonna be like what are they doing right <laughs> Look at my black eye. Um, I love doing, I love taking off my makeup with this um, makeup, like makeup remover balm, cleanser balm, because my mascara just, you know, she's sturdy, like, it never wants to come off. So sometimes you gotta, yeah. I love taking heels class again. I always love taking heels class. I always feel like a bad bitch. I will continue to take beginner poll with my friends because I like watching them do it. It's more of a like group experience for me than um, uh, like I'm gonna train super hard at learning how to do pole type of thing. Cause I'd rather just go do the genre of dance that I like to do because like LA is just the perfect place to do that. I could take pole classes for fun, like literally anywhere. But the best commercial dance classes that I could ever find are gonna be out here. So I definitely want to prioritize that. I just brought down all these packages um, and I was looking for my camera. So I just got like kind of excited and decided that I should go downstairs and get the packages. And then I ended up trying, like attempting to carry all of these at once. But I accomplished it. Boss girl things. Ooh, Lane Combs sent me something. How cute. But they sent me the clean girl makeup starter pack. We have eyeliner. We have three um, Juicy Tubes lip glosses. We have, um, and two mascaras. But yeah, thank you, Lane Combs. Next up we got, <gasps> it's my camera. Oh. My new Sony Z, ZV-E10. Look, it says love is everywhere. I think that next week is London vlog, but it's also Valentine's Day, which is like, we got a lot going on next week. Next vlog is gonna be wild, but enjoy. Listen, oh my goodness. I literally wanna put this on like tonight. We have two bras, pairs of underwear to go along with it. Good morning, it is Friday. Finally, happy Friday. Um. I am at Pilates. I woke up and I just like got ready, took my dog on a walk. You know, you already know the daily morning schedule I showed you on Monday, hello. We wake up, we put on clothes, we take Luna on a walk. That's the schedule. I have Pilates, so I put on this new Gym Spark set. It's really cute, I love it. 
Like, I love it. Heading into Pilates right now, it is literally an hour and 15 minutes, which I've never, I haven't done this class. Usually I do the hour class with sprinting and Pilates, but I'm doing the hour and 15, so it's sprinting, Pilates, sprinting again. So hopefully I don't pass away. I'm already three minutes late, but you know, we got time to waste because this class is long. Okay, we are back at the donation box after Pilates class. Pilates class was so good. I made a video on my TikTok, which I'm about to edit, of um, just my entire class. I'm going to edit it together. And I was wearing AirPods so I could, like, talk. Let's see if I could do this. So, you push it in like this, and then you push it up. Ah! I did it! Okay. Guys! Eating something next nice day. Oh, you like it? It's cute. I like it, but it looks like a mom. <laughs> oh, the best. Yes. We got a butter cake, y'all. If you've never had a butter cake from CBK, the this best took us two ever. days to decide to eat this. We were here yesterday. <laughs> were we here yesterday? Yes. Yesterday? We were here literally yesterday. After a day of shopping with Leilani, um, came back with a bag from Urban, a bag from Garage, and a bag from Free People. And I came back and I got ready for bed. Oh my gosh, literally, I didn't tell you guys. So, what we're dealing with right now, Jada told me that like she has to move the trip to London. So we're trying to figure out like what days we're gonna fly in now because she needs to move her trip. So it's like a little bit of stress, but so we're gonna figure it out. Okay, good night vlog, see you in the morning, bye. Unbox my new camera, I'm excited. I've actually heard like great, great things about this camera. So I already have high hopes. Let's do this. Okay, I got it. Hey, there we go. That was not aesthetic at all. Ooh, yay. Camera body, look how cute. Oh my goodness. Yay. I'm gonna add a strap. I'm gonna put the strap on it because I don't like not having straps on my camera. Came with this little, um, I think this is for the microphone because I'm like assuming this is a microphone here. So this is what you're supposed to put on it. Like you're supposed to go like this. Okay, let me let me do it. Let me do that. Oh, perfect. Oh, look how cute. Okay. Yeah, somebody on my TikTok recommended that I buy an external lens instead of buying the lens that came with the camera because they said that it would be better. So the letters. <laughs> Sony E15mm F1 F1.4 G. If you read that and you know what that means, like, how? Hi, vlog. Oh, here's my sweater that caused a huge friendship fallout. <laughs> Our dilemma of the week is um, basically it's Jada. It's not a dilemma, y'all. Don't tell them. No, because they already know about the whole trip and everything. Oh. Our Guys, dilemma. I'm about to have a breakdown. <laughs> so I, I told them yesterday down. already a little bit. I was like, we we have to we're reworking our London trip next week because Jada has. I literally had to cancel the entire trip and well, not cancel, reschedule and move everything. And I'm still in the process of doing that because I just found this out two days ago. Yesterday. Two. Yeah, literally yesterday. Yesterday, oh, yesterday. was confirmed that Jada. We were already having an issue. We we're trying to figure out was almost canceling the trip last week. So now we have. Yeah, we were almost about to cancel the trip last week because this was tripping. <laughs> but it's fine though. So now we have this situation, which is like actually important. So we're now we're really rescheduling it. So now I think Jada's gonna come the second week the after week. Valentine's Day. So Which she won't be in next week. alone on Valentine's Day by myself in this apartment, twiddling my thumbs. Like ah. she's gonna get a lot done now. Yeah, I'm still gonna go. So next what? week is still like, gonna what? be the London like, vlog. Just life. I'm still gonna. Yeah, yeah. One thing about me though, I am stressed because I'm not gonna be like I'm not like a person who's gonna do pointless shit and just be lazy for two weeks. I'm not sitting around doing nothing. So I'm actually stressed because I need to. I'm about to try to figure out exactly what I'm gonna do. That needs to be productive, because there's no way. If I'm sitting here doing nothing, I'm going to cry. But it's okay. It's okay, because we're just moving it back. So Jada won't yeah. be in next week's weekly vlog, she'll be in the weeks after, the week after that, because I'm going for two weeks, two weeks and a half. So she'll be in week two of London's weekly vlog. And then I come home and she won't even be here. But 
it all it happens sometimes, y'all. This is what being a content creator is like. So a little in uh, Jada is like she got booked for something important and like things that you get booked for are so last minute like in LA You can't even like anticipate. It's just so like She's like, can you do this? You and you're come, not gonna you turn down. In two weeks Okay, yeah, but like I'm not thinking I'm gonna have something in two weeks. It's just like it's yes. just quick and last minute I remember when I was living in Fort Lauderdale. I moved home for a little bit I would still be getting jobs out here and like I literally would have to buy a flight here and, and a round trip back and cancel all my plans like in a week it just be like that. You have to be up and ready to take any opportunity because you're not missing it for nothing. <laughs> I'm not missing that. I'm not missing the bag. You know what I mean? I'm not missing the bag. <laughs> I'm actually happy that we had this like little oopsie last week because it kind of prepped me for you not to come. <laughs> <laughs> but when it happened this week, it was, was like, God's plan. Yeah. It's like the universe was telling me that I'm not supposed to be there during this that week for some reason. Because it was first, it was that, and now it's this. No, oh, I feel like the universe is telling you that you need to be here, not that you shouldn't be there. Type thing. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. That yeah, was yeah. Good. That's a good way to put it. Positivity. That's a good way to put it. Like, don't leave. Type B. The universe is like, don't leave me, don't leave me. <laughs> All right, guys, I really want to see the side by side comparison in a clip from the vlog. So I'm about to start using my new camera from this moment on. Ready? Bah! Is this with the lens or now? We're back! Yeah, look. Whoa, it's cinematic. It's, it's nice. Like it's giving us filter per skin on 10. Natural face tune in it, bro. <laughs> in it, bro. Okay, so me and Jada are, now we're on the new camera forever, so my quality is always gonna be busting now. We better be ready. Me and Jada are about to like do a little FaceTime fun game night thing with our friends from England before we head over. So maybe I'll add some clips of that. I don't know yet what's gonna happen tonight, but. Let's watch this. Oh, back. Luke's, Luke's offended because I said he's my friend. What do you gotta say, babe? So, tell him the two, your two cents. Hey, listen, yeah. She just needs me to say boy in front of her. We're playing Monopoly. We're getting drunk all together. It's lit vibes before we're all together in England together. Like it's our first game, you know. And I'm gonna win, of course. I'm no. Mm -hmm. That's it. Monopoly, y'all. <laughs> Wait, like your two cents is, is that. that I always, I always win. win, and no one has ever beat me at this game, so I'm going to win. Other two cents, my other two cents is that Gabby's gonna start, Gabby's gonna get mad at me and start an argument. Oh she my al god. She always fights with me when she loses. Monopoly. Listen. <laughs> she's starting it off, she's gonna start. I ain't even say nothing. Jada's a sore loser, man. What? That's really what it is. <laughs> Be like Luke, Luke. The, the weak link. She be playing the weak link. She be like, she be like, sell it. She be like, sell it, sell it. <laughs> no, I don't. Yeah, you do. No. First of all, I have headphones on. They're sound canceling. But I'm literally winning this game. I'm green. I don't even know if y'all can see. Jada. And Gabby's over here mad. I love queen. She's already starting with her excuses. No, I'm, not, I'm not mad. Say hey. No, no one said say hi. Okay, bye. Y'all are really hiding your faces right now. Cute. Cute. Okay, vlog. Um, let me update you guys on what we're doing tomorrow. So, you know, as we do every day, uh, we have three days until I go to London. So I'm a little nervous, but I'm really excited about my new camera. I'm super happy that today ended the way it did. I'm gonna put on the jammies that Pink sent me. <laughs> I'm gonna put them on. Already, yeah, and once you subscribe, turn that little bell icon on so you're notified every time Gabby <laughs> upload. And yeah, more videos to come. Yeah, so these are my jammies. Look, guys, this is what Pink sent me. They're really hot pink, but it's really cute. I really like it, actually. I can't even show you because, like, okay, but it's just like a matching set. Got long, got the long pants. Ooh very grateful that they sent me this they also sent me like bras and underwear and stuff like that but i really don't wear bras i can't lie i don't wear bras and i have no itties so it is a dress i'll show you i'm gonna see babe look <laughs> look i'd rather wear nip covers i'm a nip cover type of chick i'm a nip cover type of chick like i will take a like a flower nip cover i'll take the sticky bras like anything that just like sticks to my stuff is better because I'm really, really like, I have really small chest. So if there's any gap in between it, 
I, I think it's ugly. Like if I'm wearing a shirt and then you see like the gap of the bra and the shirt, like that's so icky to me. I think Victoria's Secret snapped. I saw did you because yeah. I didn't want to go to bed looking like this. I want to catch a flat right now. Yeah. Tell me why I'm actually so hungover. That is not okay. I ordered um, Starbucks, but I just got off my therapy meeting and I'm so happy I'm doing therapy because it just makes me, it makes me so focused on myself and always in a working on myself mindset. And I feel really happy about my meeting this morning. Me and Jada just played It Takes Two last night after the, I ended the vlog after we were fighting about Monopoly. <laughs> I finished Pilates class. Literally, this is the studio I wanted to show you. Ew! I did not do that good today, but I only took a 45 minute class. But I just feel like when I look ratchet, like my hair is not done, like this outfit wasn't giving. I don't do that good. I literally need to wash and blow dry my hair like right now. I have no time. My appointment's supposed to be literally right now. I hope she doesn't go yet. <laughs> Guys, she rescheduled. <laughs> Just kidding. It's okay. Um, she rescheduled to tomorrow morning, so that's fine. I'm not even tripping about it. Um, I'm just gonna do a, a slick back braid today because why not? I like doing. Since I just washed my hair, I'm thinking I'm gonna blow it out anyways and try to do a slick back style and just do it with like braiding hair because I think I have some braiding hair in here. So it worked out because she said that it's gonna take like five hours and I didn't really want to spend five hours doing my hair today anyways. <laughs> Hi, we're about to head to dinner at a restaurant called Cachalé, me, Jada, and Leilani. Um, we're about to get in the car right now. We're probably gonna be late because everything's just so far. All the good restaurants are in West Hollywood, literally 45 minutes away. Guys, Leilani has literal Sephora in here. Like, what? Every foundation I've ever seen in my life. Like, for real. That's crazy. I'm sorry, sorry. Like, look. Morning vlog. Today is the last day of our weekly vlog. And so much happened this week so far. I'm, like, nervous to edit this because I'm, like, dang. Like, I actually did a lot. Um, but today is actually our final prep day and I'm kind of mad because I left so much for the last day one So I blow dry my hair just now again, you know, I did a braid yesterday But I blow dry did it wash it this morning I'm about to take a little on a walk and then hopefully my braids lady will be here to start last night <laughs> Last night I didn't record too 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 much because We were just like in the moment just hanging out as girls, but it was a really fun night going out to dinner with them again and um like just doing fancy dinner. I want to do it with them all the time because like that's just like we're 20, we're 21 now. We can get little you can get little sips, have good food. Catch was amazing. Like tell me why I got so tired though. I literally came back, didn't even do my didn't even do my whiteboard, didn't even do um didn't even take off my makeup. Guys, my hair is blonde. What even? I've never had blonde hair in my life. I don't know. I think it needs to grow on me. It's making me look like kind of just like darker, but it's also giving like, I just look like I have a, a tan. I don't know if I like it or not. But like, it's the hair is pretty regardless. It's just like crazy that I have blonde hair now. Anyways, I don't even have time to OD it because I need to get to my sugaring appointment. And I am about to go pop two Advil's before I go. Hopefully it helps a little bit. <laughs> I love how I said that I did my laundry that one day. Like, look at my laundry right now. Like, I did not put it away. I'm still waiting to put it away. Like, look at my the state of my closet. Oop, not right there. That's the state of my closet. So, to get sugared, vacation prep is going crazy. My hair is blonde, I'm scared. I have not let somebody else other than my, being, my boyfriend um, be around my areas since like, 2018. I've never been sugared before. I'm also getting a vagina facial, like whatever that is. Sugaring NYC. We're here. Yeah, I'm, I'm nervous. 
Okay. I'm sugaring now. Have you relaxed? A long time ago. Okay. It's okay. At least it's pink. Okay, I'm gonna have you together and then spread your legs. Oh, my hips just cracked. <laughs> I'm doing a vish. How do you say it? Vishacial? Vajacial. What's after? Yes. Oh, we're gonna wax like right away. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was like a prepping thing. No. Oh no. <laughs> you just, you see a lot of coochies. Uh, yeah. Hey, period. <laughs> oh, you do men. Oh my gosh. I would so make my boyfriend do this. <laughs> Did you start? Yeah. Oh, you're already doing it? Yeah. Oh, it doesn't even hurt. <laughs> Okay, T. Okay, T. It was a little painful, but it wasn't crazy. Oh, 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 wow. Okay, yeah, totally. Yeah, that one, yeah. Damn, that was crazy. A lot's going on today. I literally just got these blonde braids. I've never had blonde hair in my life. I'm like having identity crisis. And now I'm getting my, my stuff sugared. <laughs> I like your energy. You're very calm. It's like making me feel better about it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're like halfway done. We're at the worst part, but we're we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting it from the back. It sounds it's not pleasant, but it's not anywhere close to as bad. I did it, y'all. I survived. Ooh. That gave me that has my heart racing, like literally an adrenaline rush. Like my legs are literally shaking. No toes for me. Anyways, now it's the actually the vajacial time. <sighs> I'm so happy that that is over. It's like a steam facial. My phone's gonna die, but I have a facial on. on. Okay, that was crazy, low key. It was really painful, but if I didn't do the vajacial or whatever, I feel like I'd be a lot more sore than I am. So I'm like happy that that was like the outcome she's like feeling like very 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 soothed i picked up this beautiful bouquet from strawberries by Itzel because i saw it on tiktok so freaking cute and yummy and then i did my normal night prep but it wasn't recording audio i don't know why but you know i just kind of went over how i have blonde hair and i was like that's crazy then um i started to pack tuesday morning it took like three hours i finished packing successfully so we got I literally filmed it and I filmed the whole entire thing um, for my TikTok, but somehow I was filming on this camera and it literally um, was in slow-mo and had no audio. So I was like, what even? I just pressed something, but I just finished cooking this HelloFresh meal. I feel like a chef when I cook HelloFresh. I literally love HelloFresh so much. Me and Jada always do it because um, I don't know. We're just like not that inclined to cook. So because we're not... HelloFresh helps us a lot teaching us how to make all the meals and like this is not sponsored I just want to tell you guys <laughs> Okay, we are officially in full-on self-care mode. I'm finally like getting really excited that I see my man Tomorrow I jump on a flight technically. I'm seeing him the next day Even though I got a wax they don't completely Wax your whole entire body because I just got a Brazilian so I just shaved my legs and completely went hairless <laughs> I'm, i love having nights like this where i just do like a face mask and really just wind down before i have a lot going on i was actually really stressed this morning because i was like oh i'm really about to be up and going and going to iceland and doing a whole bunch of stuff this upcoming week and that is a little stressful like it becomes sometimes it becomes a lot so i really wanted to take this time right now but I also am finally like really clocking that I'm about to see my man, my man, my man, my man, like whatever. But I really, when I'm away from him, I try to really focus on myself and we really try to be on our own schedules because otherwise, like if I sit there just sad or like my mind is, you know, in England with him or just like missing him all the time, I just don't get done when I need to get done. Every time I've seen him so far, I usually am not sitting there the week before just like super excited to see him So that's like why I haven't really talked about it this week Even though like I feel like most people would be like I get to see my man soon, I get to see my man soon But as soon as I get into that mindset of like Oh, I get to see my man It goes by so much slower Like literally Then I start to like think of every day And I'm like four days, three days, two days And like Luke is that type of dude to do that 
So he was already texting me like throughout the week, like I'm seeing you, like are you excited to see me? Like I'm like, yes, of course I'm excited to see you, but I'm not like deeping it. But I just deeped it in the shower <laughs> five seconds ago. So I'm really excited. But I started editing and I just realized that I was, I've been talking so fast this whole vlog because sometimes my head just goes faster than my mouth. So I'm excited to do weekly vlogs so I can really watch myself and understand myself and, you know, kind of see what my life is looking like. I don't know. I will see you guys tomorrow. I really don't have much planned as I told you, but I'll definitely see you guys when I'm getting on the plane. I can't tell, but I'm sitting on my suitcase and I'm nervous but excited to catch this flight. I feel like I'm always nervous and excited because, you know, a 10 hour flight is like, ugh. But I have my laptop to edit and I will catch you guys on the way to the airport. I'm nervous because we're already like running late. For She's the running okay. late. No, we are. I'm not going. <laughs> <laughs> You're driving. Hey y'all. <laughs> Gid will be there in next week, so it's all good. Look at this gigantic suitcase. Ooh. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's this is my best friend Angel. He is the manager. And he's yeah. cool. <laughs> AF. All right, guys. Um, let's go. Period. Hi. I just literally started choking and dying as soon as I sat down at my gate. Um, I feel like everybody definitely thinks I just have COVID. But I just, it, I swallowed and my spirit went down the wrong throat. I just started dying. Anyways, my flight's gonna board in 10 minutes. And this airport is so nice and pretty. Like I've never, I've never been to the international side of the airport because I um, usually only fly domestic. And if I fly to uh, to England, I usually end up flying from Florida. So this is the first time that I've been in this terminal, and it is so pretty. I wish like, this was so close. I am now on the flight. See, it's like probably really loud. Can you hear me? Eh. Um, but so far, I have this all of this space in this entire row, and I got like the front seat, so there's no seat in front of me. Yeah, but it's nice, nice, nice. So far, I'm happy. That this is the end of our first weekly vlog. I'm on my way to London, as you know, and I'm very excited to continue this. So, we will catch up next week at the same spot pretty much when i land in london for the week i hope you guys enjoyed bye, bye.